hello welcome back to my channel good morning everybody now I want to show about how to integrate the Siemens power meter PAC 3220 <coughs> to CPU 1200 series using the tier portal okay we will need the cover copy Mm. Ah, nice okay now I want to continue about that in this picture this is the application of mine my project so in here how communicate or integrate the two device PLC and power meter the Centron PAC uh, 3220 uh, Pia propinet meter that here's the series okay in my video already connected them in the end of this power meter so here we are now I want to show the similar the module propinet here they are my module propinet the series Okay, the series the same to here must be remember that the series originally connected uh, support to minimum requirement tier portal person person 16 and last person is the 17 Okay. So in this video, I already installed that. So here we are. There are two uh, cable. First connected to RG, connected to PLC, and then this is connected to my computer. So the try I can remove that from my computer. But uh, actual, actual, who's there? So now I want to open my project. Before I open my project, I have to uh, explain that device of the current transformer, each of current transformer connected to single phase because in my home just have a single phase so that's why this I make the parallel connections single phase to get the line to neutral okay and then in here I have the red cable a single cable or single face connected to each of the okay it's of the, the current transformer so in here just have one okay from here to here just one cable connections connected to uh, my load heater okay <clears throat> now I want to show my project before showing my project I'm gonna show about uh, link of my support power meter to PLC here they are I'm using the JSDMO file version 2.34. I already download that. So, so that's why the JSDMO file support to my computer. So my VLC tier portal. Okay, I already download that. 
here they are and then install the SD web file to software and in this video I'm gonna show about my project here they are I'm gonna show about uh, part of my project not here but part of my project especially for power consumption only okay here they are uh for consumption only okay here they are this is a uh, group of the voltage line to neutral and then group voltage line to line and then group uh amper line to line and there are have uh there are, they have average value each of group right average line to neutral average of line to line and average of, uh, current should be current here okay must be created and then about the power picture and then the power picture there are the group here they are the active power reactive power and power factor and then THD and then energy here they are energy okay so my lid okay now I want to download the program to PLC because in here I'm just So about the my program. Okay, here they are. Now I want to program download the program to PLC. This is the real real integrate the PLC to my power meter. Wait a few minutes, maybe that connection to my yes. Okay, we got it. CLC IP address. In here I want to make a uh, minutes the my screen I want to minutes my screen ah. now I want to monitor my monitor all parameter our meter from the person So here they are already done. Okay. Okay, this is the similar to here. Okay, similar. And then here is doesn't have the voltage line to neutral because my connection just parallel, parallel uh, single line one phase or single line two power meter okay so that's why the value line to line doesn't have in power meter so that's why the diaprata doesn't have to what about the uh, input this is the amp of each offline have the amp. Okay, let me see. Okay, here they are. Okay. 
in here align to first line second line and third line we got in here okay and then line two this is the emperor in natural okay what about the another file for active power active power active power and power vector okay here they are okay active power active power zero zero everything is zero okay now i want to start my load or my heater okay now we got the value because the load already done already uh, have the emperor so that's why here we have to back again here they are this is the emperor real emperor from Heater. Okay, here they are. And then this is the active power. Okay, here they are. Active power. Here they are. Active power line one. Okay, active power line one, and then active power line two, and then active power line three. So we got that, and then here's that average, average active power. So in here, I'm gonna show about the reactive power. Reactive power. Where are you? Okay. Everything has the value. And then pair of This is the total. We got the total. Here's below. Should be okay, but this is the problem. Now I want to make fix the KVA. KVA should be. I'm gonna repair again. Wait a few minutes. Okay, now I want to. After fix it, the program now will to download that program again. Download that. Okay. Finish. Now I want to show about the program again. Here they are. This is for what? And this is for things. Okay, zero point zero four kappa. So in here I got that far. Okay, in here I got what? Okay, the similar. And then what about the here they are energy? Frequency, what about the frequency? Let me see. Frequency, here they are. I got forty nine 
4.94 okay 95 okay the same and then this is the same right it's gonna be okay it's gonna be okay and then here's the energy if range and then here's the active active energy so in here we got here okay we got in here in power vector we got 3.22 kilowatt hours in here we got that it's the same this unit is one hour if we compare to kilowatts so we got that three point two hundred eighteen same to here okay and then the energy reactive energy active expo energy active expo this energy energy reactive yeah energy reactive so let's continue again we got here okay the similar because this is the compared to far and here's the kilo far so if I compare that to kilo far we got the four point 63 alpha okay and then this is the jewel operating system okay the same so in this video already done how to integrate the power meter with the power meter Connect it to PLC basic to here. Okay, this is connected to PLC uh, using a model propnet propnet module. This is the new persons or new product. This is the new product of Siemens. Okay, and here already done. It's minutes like the, my project already done success so here okay thank you very much if you have uh, questions please type below in my link and then if you want to if you're watching to another video you can subscribe my youtube and then you will get new video in the next time okay thank you very much i will come back very very soon in the next video bye bye